Hi, and thanks for choosing to watch this C-Logic video on how you can combine the use of customer service cases and the service calendar in Microsoft Dynamics CRM. In other videos on the C-Logic YouTube channel, I've shown how to work with cases and the service calendar as mutually exclusive functionality. This video shows you how to combine the use of both elements so that cases and service calendar bookings are linked. A scenario for this might be that a customer phones in with a problem with one of your installed products. To begin with, you hope you may be able to resolve the issue over the phone and therefore carry out relevant activities. It might soon become apparent, however, that you need to send an engineer on site to perform a fix, so you want to use the service calendar functionality to book that engineer but keep it linked to the case. So let's fast forward and look at our case. We've added the information and associated the appropriate knowledge base article. Some notes have been added and a record of an initial phone call has been completed. Finally, a task has been completed which suggests an engineer visit is required. With that in mind, we need to schedule a service activity. There are two ways to do this. Go to Add in the ribbon and click Service Activity. Or go to Activities in the left-hand menu and click Add New Activity, Service Activity. the new service activity window appears and note that it pulls our customer information through and importantly links this service activity to our case. At this point you could simply schedule the activity if you know the whereabouts of your resources but if you want to use the full service calendar availability functionality then click on the schedule button. Now you're into scheduling a service as per the video Scheduling in the Service Calendar of Microsoft Dynamics 2011. Choose the service. Choose the resource you require. Specify a range of times the customer is available and then click Find Available Times. Choose the best one and then click Schedule. Now fill in any further information such as additional notes and then click save and close when you're all done. We can now go back to our case and see the service activity scheduled in Activities. We can also go to the service calendar and see our activity. Remember that the service engineer will also see this activity in his calendar and you could set up workflows to email a job notification with associated information to that service engineer. When the engineer completes the activity, it will move the service activity to closed activities, thus providing a full audit trail of actions against this case. If the customer is happy, you might well then close the case. A final point to note is that if you have created a case and a service activity independently, you can link them at any time. Just go into the service activity, whichever way you want to, and set the regarding field under details to your case. Well that's it on how you can practically work with cases and the service calendar together in Microsoft Dynamics CRM 2011. I hope you found it useful and thanks for watching this C-Logic video.